let's leave that in 2023. The toilets, leave them. Thank you. Mm. That raspberry is tart and sweet. I'm obsessed. Look how cute it is. And look at how they wrapped it. And then they gonna send CPS to come get me to take me to a home. <laughs> Lock me up. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your boy Larry, and I'm back again with another video. So, I just went grocery shopping and I got home um, not too long ago. I didn't do the most in the grocery store because I'm real. I didn't have a quarter to get a cart, so I was walking around the store filling up my little bags. When my bags got to the point to where it was gonna go heavy, that's when we started heading to the cash register so we could walk out because I'm not about to fill my bags up to the room and then self check out and get out. I filled it up to a good amount and I was like, oh, okay, I'll come back next time when I got a quarter. That's how we, that's how we did that. But yeah, I'm gonna show y'all what I got and then I'm gonna put it up and then I'm gonna show y'all what I got for Paris because you know I had a couple plans of places I had to go when I went up there and I very much did hit those spots so I'm very much am going to show y'all what I got in that order a what? a case spot <laughs> sale like the shelves be bare and the hallways be full of dang like little the little crates like they about to restock and I'm like girl you should have restocked this morning what are you doing but they do because the shelves be bare. How I come in at like the noon, the afternoon, after work. Hey, y'all had all day. So I don't have enough employees. Girl, well, that's not my problem. Hire some of them people to be outside asking for food. Anyway, <laughs> a screaming mess. So y'all, they had the caramel waters um, on sale. They were like $1.29 um, each, and they had so many different flavors. So I got two of the um, I got two of the uh, the peach lemonades. Then I got I got the blueberry lemonade. Then I got strawberry lemonade. Then I got some sandwich meat. I got the ham, honey ham. And then I got this um, this ice cream and strawberry cheesecake. I seen it on Instagram, and I was like, oh, let me go to Aldi. So I went to Aldi and I got it. Chuck Vanilla Swirl with the sprinkles. Then I was like, let me re-up on some yogurt. So I got this key lime. I love key lime. That's one thing about me. Key lime with the graham cracker crust. Mm. Then I got this peach yogurt. And I got this black cherry. Then I got this tropical fruit one. I don't have no butter in my refrigerator. I think I haven't had butter since Thanksgiving. I'm not even gonna lie, because I don't eat butter like that. But I put it in my, my mixed vegetables sometimes. Or like when a recipe calls for it. So I got some butter. Then I got some. Are these sweet potato tater tots? I'm about to lose it because I don't want that. Oh, these are <laughs> these are seasoned golden brown shredded sweet potato. I mean not sweet potato tater tots. Then I got um I got these Asian seasoned um medley mixed vegetables. Period. Then I got this broccoli stir fry. Then I got some bread because I just said it is about sandwiches. I already got cheese, I already got my other stuff to make my sandwiches, so, you know. Then I got a salad. They did not have my kale salad in there with the little, I think the raisins in it. So good, but they didn't have it. They had the sunflower chopped salad kit. So I got that one. And you already know I had to rip up on, on my knockoff, um, what is it called? The chocolate, the Quaker. These are the knockoff, the Quaker chocolate dip bars. They be so good. <laughs> had to and then I seen these they had the cinnamon toast crunch cookie mix and I got two because I'm gonna send one to my um, my family because whenever I see something like this I'm like oh I think my sister like oh she would like making this so I got two of these so cute. and then I got the shells and cheese because you know that's a classic I'm addicted I gotta have shells and cheese and I got this bag of chips Oh, that's a bag. I got this bag of chips. It was $7.19, so yeah. That's what I got from the grocery store. It was like $45, I think. See, that's like 
that's not even half of that's a quarter that I think that's half of what I spend normally I spend like 90 or more hundred dollars so that's what I got um, a little little Rhea just to let homie over because girl I wasn't filling up the cart because I didn't have a cart so yeah I'll get back with y'all whenever I after I put this stuff up and I'll show y'all what I got from her All right, y'all, so I'm here and I'm back and I showed y'all the bags that I got. As y'all see, I got some bangers up in here. So y'all know I'm addicted to Kappa and I don't know, like every t everywhere I turned, every store we went into, I was finding the Kappas on sale, okay? So I got four packs of socks, four packs of Kappa socks. This is white, gray, tan, Kappa. I got white, white, gray, and red. Three pair of European sizes. And then I got these all gray ones with the Kappa logos on it. And then I got these all white ones with the Kappa logos on it. So cute. And I was like, why not? And it was on sale. I don't remember how much it was. Let me see. I don't remember. I think it was like 10. Actually, I don't think it was even $10. I think they were seven or $8. Don't really remember. But yeah. And then, my jacket was not doing justice, and I was freezing out there. For real, I was freezing. So then, I got this, um, this like comfort coat from this German store. It was on sale, it was like, I think it was, girl, I don't know. I think it was like 60 or $70. But it's like this grayish blue color, and it's, it's wind resistant and water resistant. It zips all the way up. It got a pocket on the inside and it's this way on the inside. I thought it was so cute. So I got it and it was on sale. I got it. Let's try it. Let's rate it one through ten. I did it. I did it. I bought it. I like it. I bought it. I bought it. I did it. And then you know already know. You see the color and you already know. I got these jacket pants. They were on sale. What is this on the back? What happened? <laughs> I ain't even wear them and what is that? I'm about to scream. Anyway, it's like this soft material, soft like fleecy material. You can kind of, you can wear these to work and get away with it because the bottoms don't really look like jacket pants. Like you can like fold this up can get away with it. These are really cute. It's a chocolate color. I love chocolate color. And the, the store was called Reserved. I never seen it in America, but it was bumping over there because the Germans was up in there and it was on sale. And then I got this scarf. This scarf like heavy, it's soft and it's warm. And I got this from a store, a grocery store. I think it was called Coleman's and it was $19.99. So that's like the clothes I got. Uh, basically, so the next store that we went to is called Rituals, and as you can see at the bottom, it's like Amsterdam, Paris, London, and New York. Period. So, Rituals, I didn't know nothing about it. Really, honestly, I'm not gonna lie. My mom told me about it. I mean, it was in the mall that we went into, so we went in there. It's known for like the home scent, skincare, and then like the perfumes and, and colognes and stuff, right? I went in there. It smelled so good. So I had to get me a um, had to get me a home spray. This is the green, what is it called? Green carboner. Um, and it's the home smell. I got this one, it smells so good. Like, I don't even know how to explain the smell. Hold on, let me smell it so I can tell y'all. <clears throat> I can, it's smell a vision hold on. Let me tell y'all about it. And then this little part right here is actually metal. Mm, it's like a light, like a light, fresh uh, floral smell. Flesh, fresh floral smell. It's for your house, so you just like spray it in the air and it smells so good. They call them house perfumes. So, there you go, home perfume, period. Then I was over there smelling the colognes. Cause you know how I get down. I love me a cologne. And then this cologne smells so good, but they didn't have the big size, the regular size. 
So I got the small one. I was like, that's fine. Like this is the little little token. So it's uh, from Rituals and it's called Quality. What what is the name of this one? It don't even have a name. <clears throat> anyway, I don't know. It's a red bottle, y'all. <laughs> it don't even have the name on it. It just say Rituals. And Rituals is the name of the brand. Come back the box. No, it didn't come with a box. Mmm, it smells good. It's like a um Imagine like cool water but like spicy, but a little bit spicy and a little bit warmer. It's like a winter version of um a cool water. It smells so good. And it smells different from anything that I have. <clears throat> so I was like, let me try that. Period. So I got that one. And then with my stuff, I got this free gift. It's um two home home perfumes. It's the what is that one? This one is Sweet Jasmine and I can't read the other one. Oh, Sweet Jasmine and Suede Vanilla. Horn perfumes. Let me show y'all what they look like. This that little bottle. It's cute. Little bottle. I didn't pick these, pick these ones, cause, so I don't know what they smell like. Hold on, let me just spray it. I'm over it. Oh, that smells good. That's like a um, it's like a suede, bro. I'm saying it's like a suede vanilla, and that's the name. Well, there you go. That's how it was described. They described it perfectly. Suede vanilla. <laughs> hey, that was a perfect name. It smells just like it. And this one is sweet jasmine. Yes, jasmine. Yes. Jasmine smells like, wow, it smells like really like, like a real jasmine flower. It's really uh, uh, floral, really floral and fresh. It gives jasmine. Yeah, it definitely gives jasmine. I'm not even gonna hold you, it gives jasmine. It smell. it has like a, a natural herby smell to it. It smells good. That's like a, um, it's like a bedroom spray. It smells really good. Yeah, so that's what I got from Ritual. I got these three things. And also I got this little, this retinol cream. I can't find, find where it is, y'all. I put it somewhere. But that's what I got from Rituals. One store down, I got a couple more to go. Then, oh my God, I don't know if I wanna go, go do one of, one of the bankers. I can't even talk. Now I'm gonna do the little bakery. So I have been seeing this bakery on TikTok and on Instagram. Before I went to Paris, you see the name, you see it. So if y'all have seen on my TikTok, not on my TikTok, on my Instagram, I was posting video reels and stuff like that. This place is known for their mac macarons in Paris. I had put on my story these macarons. It's like an ice cream one with like a, um, not an ice cream one, but a, like a chocolate outside and it had like a ganache and cake on the inside. So good. It was like a vanilla and chocolate one. So good. Then I got macarons from here. I got one macaroon left in here, but the other ones I ate them because I thought they was gonna get hard. Cause the small ones, I feel like they're gonna dry out and get hard. So good. I posted videos on there and y'all should see them. But right now what I got in here, I got this big macaroon. This is like the last thing that I got from there. It's a big um, raspberry flavored macaroon. So good. And then I got this cute little box. Look how cute it is. And look at how they wrapped it. So cute. I'm gonna show y'all what's in here. I am about to lose it. I hope this didn't get melted. Look at the inside. How pretty. I love Paris, oh my gosh. Then they got the little card. Ooh, look. That's what I got, y'all. You get the card with your cookies. They're basically cookies. And it tells you the flavors. This is so cute. It's in English too. So cute. I got like, I think I got the six set. Look how cute. Look. Hey. I'm obsessed. I got lemon cookies and cream. I got lemon cookies and cream. 
No, that's lemon, vanilla, chocolate, black currant, violet. I got strawberry. And what's that one? And I got hazelnut. Look how cute. This packaging is everything. Here, I'm going to show y'all one. It almost made me not want to eat it. Look at it. It's a little cookie. So cute. So upscale. Love it. Mm. If I lived in Paris, I'd probably be broke. Because... Oh, my God. Girl. It's just too nice. Like, girl. Man. And this is the big old macaroon I got. I'm going to bite it. This is the big macaroon I got. I think it's raspberry. Everything. So the next two stores, I'm gonna have to speed through because my camera's about to die. And they didn't have hitters. You already know. I did. I went to Dip Q in Paris. Yeah. And did. Who's gonna stop me? Nobody. Funny story about this is it was right down the street from my Airbnb. So I was running down the street because they were about to close in about 10 minutes. When I pulled up, it was the only ones in the store. And this dude was helping us. He was so nice. And you know how I get, I'm extra. So I was like, I need to find something that I like, something that's, that says I'm here, that I'm Beyonce, period. So, so I went in there, I smelled so many different ones and I fell in love with Dosan. I fell in love with Dosan. Smells so good. I'm gonna show y'all. <coughs> I can't remember how to open them. I opened it once. But the packaging alone, y'all. Oh my gosh. Packaging is everything. You know, look at the bottom. Ooh. Dosan is like a light. And you see that 34? <laughs> look at the bag. The 34 is represents the borough of where that store is located in Paris. I had to do my big one. I had to do my big one. Dosan is like, it's like a light jasmine, floral, musky smell. Musty, well. Not musty, but like, you know, it give like a little, a little earth to it, you know? And that's what makes it masculine. It smells so good. I could just like, it's like a lagoon, like a lagoon, uh, lagoon smell. It's not juicy. Like earthy? Like earthy a little bit, but it's like jasmine-y and, and fresh. That's my notes on that one. It smells so good. Not even gonna hold y'all. I love it. <coughs> and that's why I chose it. I was, I was in there. I was in there. I was trying to figure out what the best smells was, and he was putting me on. I was like, yes, sir. Yes, sir. <coughs> and the packaging is so cute. I don't know what the notes are on here. I can't remember what the smelling notes are. Oh, that's how you're supposed to open it. It's all like this. It shows you. The next thing I got was an exclusive of only this one's only made in that and sold in that location of Paris. This is a special location. So this is the the 34. This is the Trent Quarter, uh, Bovard Saint Germain. Girl, you already know. I don't even know how to get this thing off. Let me pull it to the side. <coughs> Look at the bottle. Look at the at the top to Q Paris. I'm opening. Oh my god, I got a little bag. That is so cute. Look at the oh that's cute. Oh, that's how the store look. It's like a corner store. Not a corner store, but like it was on a corner. 
Oh, that's the store. Look. Oh my gosh. Ah, I'm obsessed. Look at the quality of the packaging. And it's in a little bag. Let's open it and see. <clears throat> and he was like, oh, this one only comes in one size. Boy. Because who about to spend all that money on a big one? Stop playing with me. Oh my gosh. I don't remember what this one smelled like either. So this is the bottle. And the top, the 34 again, you know, 34. Oh, it's magnetic. I can already smell it. Mm. Let me spray it in the hair. It's like, it's a deep, sweet, deep, sweet vanilla suede with little, with little spices in there. Mm, that right there, <coughs> that gives, you can't hold that one. Mm, that's strong, I like it. One spray will go a long way. This is a very sweet, very sweet and um and spicy smell not too spicy but it's a little spicy i like it <clears throat> and then you know they had to give me some samples because i was spending the big bucks so hold on i'm gonna show y'all in a minute because <clears throat> i gotta move we got you said what I went in there and dropped the bag. <laughs> so I got a couple. Whoop, I got a couple samples. I got. I got sin Then I got thirty-four Trent Square. I don't know why he got me a sample of the one that I bought. Okay. <clears throat> then I got Olini. There was this really juicy one I wanted to get, but I didn't get it because it was a toilet and I'm not dealing with toilets no more. It's gonna evaporate and you're gonna be smelling like nothing. So let's leave that in 2023. The toilets, leave them. Thank you. Anyway, I got this um, this bougie, it's called Bougie anti odor et des de Vesalis. Period. It's a candle. He said it was like a, um, like a tomato basil a deodorizer candle for the kitchen. And then I got this of of Frisa. This is the one he was talking about that's really fruity. Smells so good, 10 out of 10. Recommend, smells so good. Then the last store I went to, the last but the not least, the last but the not least. Y'all see the gold bag, y'all see the name, y'all see the star, stop playing with me. Y'all know I went in here and I acted a fool. We had to wait in line to get in the store. Wait in line. And I'm gonna put some clips up of what it looked like. Y'all probably seen it in my vlog, but the store was immaculate. The store was immaculate, beautiful. I'm talking about gold, white, blue, pretty. Everything was up. Everything was up. That store was <clears throat> everything I dreamed of and hoped of. Period. <clears throat> so when I went in there, I wanted to get my little three set and move along. Y'all see this? I, don't, I can't remember what the girl name is. I was about to say, Mashonda wrapped my stuff and gave it to me. But look, it's wrapped. I got a three set. Let's unwrap it. Ah! They wrap the stuff with the ribbon and everything. Oh my gosh, like the experience. The experience. The experience. When you spend money in Paris, you spend money in Paris. Oh my gosh! They got a little bag. Look. Ah! They're all that they all got their own bags. Uh, so cute. Three different bags for three different smells. Yeah. Yeah, I did. Now look. Look how pretty. Uh. They do the most. Oh my gosh, hold on, can I get it out? This one is Oud Maisin. Uh, Oud Maisin. <laughs> I'm a little dyslexic. Let me 
that. Ooh, amazing. I was going with whatever she was telling me. Man, that stuff was smelling so good that she showed me. This one is called Sensual, In Sensual Instinct. Look how cute the bottle is. Oh my gosh. Ugh. So cute. And then this one is called Velvet. Velvet Fantasy. Look at the bottle. The packaging, the customer service. Okay, the customer service. I'm not even going to hold y'all. It's like you had to get their attention. But it was really busy in there. But that's what I got. And my three bags. The way that she had this set up was everything. The way she had this set up was everything. Like, girl, what? Oh, my gosh. Wrap, the wrapping, the packaging. America could never. So then, me being me, I had seen the little bags in there. And I was like, oh, daddy, like, I want one of those bags. Well, I didn't say I wanted those bag, one of those bags. I was like, oh, what's the bag? What you got to do to get the bag? And the dude was like, you got to do something to get it or whatever. My dad was like... I was like, okay, well, I don't need the bag, whatever. Because I think they said you had to get three full sizes. I was like, okay, whatever. Like, I just wanted to get my three little set and kill them on, you know. And then he was like, um, I think my dad wanted to go talk to the guy. And I was like, the lady came over with the bag and was giving it to me. I was like, what's this? And he was like, oh, I talked to the guy and I told him I wanted to buy it. And then he just gave it to you. And he said, normally it's like seven euro or something like that. So, I ended up getting the bag. I seen it and I was obsessed. Look how cute it is. It's like gold reflecting on here. And it says, it has the sky with the, the clouds and the moon and the Montel logo. And then on the back it says, love, and it has Montel, it's gold. This is a super cute bag. Everything, bro, everything. Montel was everything. And then I got some samples. I got the Arabian Tonka, which the Arabian Tonka is what Montel is known for. Smells top tier. Smell is top tier. Not even gonna lie to you. If you're gonna get something, get Arabian Tonka or smell Arabian Tonka. Smells so good. Then um, Lucky Candy. Lucky Candy. This is a sweet, juicy, um, what you call it? Citrus smell. Really good. Love that one too. And then there is Wood Spice. This is more of like a masculine, spicy, almost like ebony type smell. That's a dark one. And then this one's in a bag. This one's Pure Love. Pure Love is like a, a chocolate, a chocolate vanilla one. That's like a sexy one. It smells really good. Top tier. But yeah, y'all, that's um pretty much everything I got besides the stuff I got over here. Um, well, I got this for Christmas. I got the Tiffany & Co. If y'all didn't see, I got the Tiffany & Co. Um, cologne. Oh my God, my house is about to be a mess. And I got the, I got the English Laundry Crown cologne. Smells so good. Honestly, I really went to Europe just to get like cologne and perfume. Like it's not even, it's, at this point, that's what I went for. And then I got this, um, this is at their TK Maxx. This is a balsam um, house spray. Y'all know I love balsam, I love pine. So good, love it. That's a classic smell for me. It just does it for me. And then I got a tripod, and then I got like two candles. My mom got me, um, let me show you the one my mom got me. My mom got me this candle. So good. It's called uh, Amber Clove White Musk. It smells just like that, white musk with amber. It smells so good. But yeah, y'all, that's pretty much Everything I got, I'm so excited. My trip was really good. Like, I went in there, I had in my head what I wanted to get, and I got it. And I rated 10 out of 10. I love parents, 10 out of 10 parents, I love it. They spoke English for the most part. Um, <laughs> it was like not hard because everybody was speaking different languages. I feel like English was the, uh, what'd you call it? what do you call it when you, the, the, uh, the default. That's what everybody go back to. So yeah, I loved it. The food was good. The people were nice. The culture was lit. The sites were lit. Everything was lit. Loved it, 10 out of 10. And yeah, so thank y'all so much for watching my video. Um, I'm back 
every Saturday. So set y'all clock, set y'all alarm. Saturday at 9 a.m., that's when I post. So be ready, be there or be square. Yeah, like, comment, subscribe, and show your voice of love. Peace out.